We're now at five dodging bullets in a drive through Police say a San Antonio woman fired at least eight times into a downtown McDonald's drive through window back in December. And today, an employee we talked to said it was all over an order of biscuits and hash browns. Ken's Five's Mike Jimenez has the details. Bullets went flying through this drive through window at the McDonald's on South Laredo Street. Authorities say surveillance video shows the shooting as it unfolded. We spoke with an employee who didn't want to go on camera about how it all went down. I heard the first shot. I kind of like had a late reaction. I just kind of was like, and then whenever I, the other shots started ringing out, that's whenever like all of us that were in the front kind of like ducked and slid. This is the video of the aftermath showing bullet holes through a McDonald's drive through window as police investigate. The shooting happened around 5 a.m. December 30th the McDonald's at 1330 South Laredo Street near downtown. The woman working the drive through says a woman ordered food, picked it up and drove away. About 30 minutes later, she drove back, screaming at employees that she didn't get her order. Well, when I was talking to her, I noticed that she had the wrappers on her lap. I was just like, can I see the bag? Cause I noticed the bag. You didn't give me a bag either. Even though I could see it on her lap, the employee said she tried to tell her they did give her the food. The manager checked the video and verified she was handed a bag of food, but she kept insisting she didn't. This went on for about another 30 minutes. She was hopping from the first drive through window to the second window, banging, talking, like yelling. Employees say then the woman's boyfriend showed up and also confronted employees about ignoring his girlfriend. After more arguing and a challenge to come out and fight, shots rang out. Oh shoot, like she shot. <laughs> so I kind of was, I mean, I was crying. I was scared. I was having a panic attack. Police say the woman drove away in a gold 2011 Cadillac SUV. With video surveillance and photos given to police, they were able to identify the woman as 32 year old Samantha Anthony. Anthony was arrested and booked into the Bear County Jail. She is facing a charge of aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. Mike Menace, Kids 5. Here we go again. Back upside your head with another one on Christ 17 TV. Today we're going to the dirty south, way down there at the bottom of Texas. We're going to San Antonio. And this ain't no news about Victor Wembyama neither, or Coach Pop. This is about an ongoing thing I've been seeing of people shooting at the drive-thru. They're arguing about their meal. Now, this... This ignorant lady comes, orders her food, right? Bounces, comes back in 30 minutes with the wrappers on her lap and the bag and saying she never got her fucking order. Why does people make problems for nothing? Why are people making problems out of nothing? The young lady who gave her the food could clearly see empty wrappers in a bag knowing she ate the shit with her big ass. You know what I'm saying? Big, that girl big, she ate that shit. She was still hungry coming back trying to get a free meal. So, she's arguing from, from, from the drive-thru where you get the food all the way back to where you pay at. Back and forth, banging on the windows, wanting to fight, acting an ass. Acting a damn ass. So now, she calls her boyfriend. And instead of this dude saying, hey, you tripping, take your ass home. You already got your food. He interacts in the bullshit. So you got two dummies. So now, after all this, they want them to come outside and fight. Fight for what? They don't get a paid enough at that fast food place to deal with your bullshit. How much you think they getting paid in Texas, which is one of the lowest minimum wage states, and <laughs> at McDonald's? You think them kids really want to work there, but they have to because they need some money in their damn pocket. So after all of this, <laughs> you want to shoot through the window at these young teenagers working the drive-thru. The craziest part, though, is 
with all the cameras at every drive through in every fast food joint, you think you're going to shoot and not get caught? That right there proves you're not all fucking there. Second of all, I don't know what kind of gun that lady had, that big lady, but th 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 those holes were big in that window. Second of all, why would you even shoot a gun because you didn't, because you're trying to get a free meal? You're trying to get a free meal so you're going to shoot through the drive through knowing you could hit these young ladies or young men, all those folks who work in right there in the front. It's the drive through it's the counter, it's like, what the, like, I don't get people. But this is an ongoing thing. This has been happening for months now where people are getting into it in the drive through and shooting, which nobody's going to get away. All the cameras in all the drive throughs got your license plate, got you, and you think you're going to do some stupid shit like that and get away with it. You freaking crazy. Now, what? Now what's even crazier than that is they find the lady, right? She's being charged with assault with a deadly weapon. You're shooting through the window at the girl. I think that's attempt murder, but that's Texas for you. You never know. They don't care about guns like that. You can you can do whatever and they'll be like. But you get caught with a blunt down there, they wanna they wanna hang you. Go figure, right? Go figure. You can't have no weed, but you can shoot through the drive-thru and get an assault charge. That's fucking crazy to me. That's now that's the crazy part. But this big ass lady came all the way back. She had the empty wrapper. She already ate the food and she's trying to get a free meal. Do you believe this shit? Go take your ass on a walk and lose some of that weight. Go eat you an apple. Eat you a fucking, a fucking uh, orange. Get you some celery sticks, some carrots, something. You in, eating their biscuits and hash browns or whatever else. You had a Big Mac and you want to come back and get some free, so, some, some shit for free. When they clearly see the ketchup all on your mustache. Yeah, because she looked like she probably growing a little peach fuzz here. But to be real, though, why are people so stupid? Why would you shoot at somebody because you can't get a free meal? That's the most idiotic shit I've heard. But like I said, common sense, y'all, is not too fucking common. And this is just another Texas story from down there in San Antonio. San Antonio now... I've done a few down there. They got some crazy shit going on in San Antonio. Boy, I'll tell you that. And it's just not Victor, Wimbiyama, the the illest player I've seen, I don't know, since I don't know who. The kid is amazing. I had to switch it up and put a little bit of positivity on a negative story. But when it's all said and done, the San Antonio police... Found the hamburger alert, because that's what she looked like. Somebody trying to get a free burger. You know what I'm saying? Who already had the rappers ketchup all here on her chin. And talking about, I didn't get a plate. I didn't get a bag of food. These people are crazy. With that being said, man, don't be a dummy, man. Don't be a dummy and don't be a crash dummy, okay? Hit that like. Hit that subscribe. It won't cost you a damn dime. Like I tell you every time around this time. Don't try to get no free food when you already ate and, and paid. And don't try to spray up the joint because you only going to jail. But, but in San Antonio, you might not be going to jail. You might get probation. Who knows? Because they said assault with a deadly weapon instead of just shoot at these kids through the window because they won't give you some free food. And that's an assault charge. An assault charge when you put these paws on somebody. When you're shooting at somebody... That's attempt murder, because even if you hit the girl, you don't know if if the little girl going to live or die, depending on where she gets shot at. But this is the shit that's going on. So people, young kids, teenagers, if you're going to work in a fast food joint, try not to work the drive through window, because there's a lot of shit going on in the last few months. Be the cook. Be the guy who sweeps up and cleans up the tables. But hand out the food, you got to deal with these idiots and 
people like this who try to get a free meal who, who she says she's seen the bag with the empty wrappers of the food. So this big hungry son bitch trying to get some free food and then end up shooting at this young lady. Out of pocket. And I'll catch you on the flip side with that one. I just couldn't believe the motherfucker got the food, came back with a big ass, and tried to get a free food, and then got mad because they got you on camera getting a damn bag, and now you getting mad because you're still hungry. Go make a fucking sandwich at home. Jesus, catch you on the flip side, man.